Let's talk about monitors. You're probably wasting performance on your PC or overspending your money. That's why in this video, I'll show you my top three gaming monitors that you can get right now for three different prices. Of course, there are going to be more monitors down below in the description in case you have a higher or a lower budget. So keep that in mind. These are not the only monitors that I will recommend because you will have the other ones in the description. And I will also explain what type of PC do you need in order to have this monitor and in the description as well i will leave different pcs for this type of monitors without more to say let's start with the list with the first monitor we have the aoc 24 g2 24 inch frameless gaming monitor this one is 170 bucks it's on a discount right now you save 60 dollars which is a lot and you get a 144 hertz one millisecond of response time gaming monitor that it's also high adjustable overall a great monitor to start with high resolution refresh rates. I have a 144 hz monitor and believe me that the difference between 60 hz and 144 is huge, especially when playing esports titles, which is what you're aiming for when you buy one of these monitors. If you want to have a better quality or if you play games like Red Dead Redemption 2, Fly Simulator, you want to go for resolution instead of refresh rate. But if you play esports titles like CSGO and you want to play competitive, you at least going to need a 144 hz monitor and a capable PC of course. And if you buy a probably PC for this monitor i would recommend spending around 800 dollars at least to around a thousand and two hundred dollars although if you spend thousand and two hundred dollars good chances are that you're going to be able to run a 240 hertz monitor as well which is not going to be on the list but it's going to be in the description so maybe you even want a higher refresh rate monitor then you will have that one down below this monitor comes with an hdmi a display port and a bga port the one that i recommend the most actually is hdmi i had some problems with display port in the past in a bunch of monitors and it always breaks so in my opinion i recommend hdmi but of course if you want this build port you have the option this one also has an ips panel which is different from tn and ba and it's the best panel in terms of colors so the colors that you're going to see on this monitor are going to be much nicer than a va or a tn monitor with the next one we have a 1440p 165 hertz monitor that's 27 inches I think this one is one of the best in terms of price to performance but it's $300 if you have the money to spend on a monitor but you also have the PC I think this one is going to be one of the best options for you because you combine performance with resolution which is what I like the most for overall games even if you play competitive games or you want to play high-end video games this one is going to adapt to the situation it also has one millisecond of response time it's just incompatible and you also have that IPS panel which is going to make everything look nicer so if you have have a gaming PC from $1,500 to let's say $2,000, I think this one is going to be the right one for you. Now of course there are some bad deals from $1,500 to $2,000, so make sure to buy the right gaming PC. If you don't know, I have a bunch of videos on my channel helping you to find the right one, but if you buy the right one, this monitor should be your best option for that type of budget. But once again, it really depends on your situation. If you really want to compete on esports titles, you don't want to go for this monitor, you want to go for a 280 hertz monitor at 1080p instead of this one so it really depends on case by case but if you want a mix of everything this one is going to be great and the last one we have a super high-end gaming monitor that's around 650 dollars i know it's really pricey we are talking about the gigabyte m28u 28 inches 144 hertz monitor that's also 4k two milliseconds of response time i think this is the type of monitor that i would get if i was into 4k gaming but also heavy product activity let's say like really heavy video editing i think a 4k monitor would be nice to see everything better but also if i play high end video games i think a 4k monitor it's actually the best option now of course this one it's pricey if you have the budget there's no doubt that it's a great monitor but there are some 4k monitors that are on a budget but of course they are not going to be just as good and this one has a 144 hertz display so it's also going to be great for competitive games of course your pc has to be a great gaming desktop i would spend at least two thousand dollars on the gaming pc if i wanted to get this monitor but you're going to have to search for the right parts but if you can buy it and you do a lot of work you edit videos you want to play at 4k you want to compete you want to do basically everything and you have 650 dollars to spend on a gaming monitor i think it's actually a great choice but if you're working on a budget of course don't buy this monitor so that was the whole list i know it was a short video but i didn't want to make it too long and if you have any questions 
questions, leave it in the comment section and I will reply as fast as possible. And if this video was helpful for you, please feel like and subscribe, but most importantly, hit that bell button so you get notified when I upload this type of content, which I do from 3 to 5 times a week. Thank you guys for watching, thank you for the support, and I will see you on the next one.